big birthday pancake for the birthday bear! <laughs> you gotta fill it up with big presents and love. Have a blast. It's Bossy's birthday, everyone! And that means he gets to do the... Birthday Shuffle! Have a blast, because it's your birthday. Yeah. You can't Yay! wait till it's your birthday again. Birthday cake roll! My birthday lasted forever. Yay! For me, <laughs> you should have. <gasps> we made you a birthday board game. It's called Bossy Wins. <laughs> There's only one rule. Bossy, Bossy wins. wins! Best rule ever! <laughs> now it would be bedtime if it weren't time for a super great stay up late Bossy's birthday sleepover! On a school night? Yep. Gran Gran said you could stay over because it's a special occasion. Yay! Birthdays are the bestest thing in the whole world. Is tomorrow really just gonna be a normal day? If by normal you mean not your birthday, then yes. But your next birthday will be here before you know it. Take a look. Here's today's birthday, and your next one is right... <gasps> Here. Not so bad, huh? What? That's like forever from now. Or like a whole year. Why can't every day be my birthday? Because <laughs> that's not how birthdays work. Now, good night, Bossy. Night, Turtle. Night, Mom. Night, Mrs. Bear. I dub thee Sir Bossy, the bold, Sir Turtle, the tender, and Dame Bissy, the big and strong, may ye knights act with honor. Be good and enjoy some pizza. Ahem. Fellow knights, what amazing adventure shall we go on? Actually, I, Queen Mom, have an adventure for you. Can you pick three pizzas for us to order? Our first adventure! Indeed. King Dad trusts you to choose the best pizzas in all the land. We will not let your majesties down. Time for the first step of our adventure. Checking the menu. Whoa! Let I, Dame Bissy, the big and strong, assist Sir Bossy the Bold. Kimchi scallion, halloumi lettuce and tomato. There's like a gajillion pizzas in here. But how do we choose three when they all look so yummy? Uh-oh, Princess Cindy's really hungry. We better order soon. We don't want her to throw a temper tantrum like last time. We gotta hurry for Princess Cindy! That looks and smells amazing. But which flavor is it? Let's ask that witch. <laughs> this is it, the perfect kite. Well done, Kubogia. Now, where's Bossy? Right here. Behold, no instructions needed. Wow, that is a really awesome kite. Let's see how they fly. It's time to fly these kites as high as we can. <gasps> wow, a kite with the whole can fly. So cool. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. Now wait till you see mine. <laughs> okay, no more Mr. Nice Bear. <laughs> ah, it's going up, it's going up, and it's coming down. And now it's in a tree. Would you like me to help fix your kite so it can fly? Don't worry, it'll fly. I got this. Ha! Oh no! Huh? I saw that coming. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean for that to happen. It's okay. 
Grangrin and I can always make new kites. I thought if my kite was bigger and better, it would give us all good luck. Now I just feel like I gave everyone bad luck. I don't know about that. But I do know if you want to build a kite that flies, it helps to listen and follow instructions. Then it's time for me to listen to your instructions and make this up to the both of you. It's the moment you've all been waiting for. The mystery twist! First, everyone pick a partner on your team. You will do your partner's activity, and they will do yours. <gasps> mystery oh, twist! <gasps> but I don't know how to do anybody else's activity. Take some time to learn your activity from your partner. The race will begin soon. Turtle. You ready to teach me your egg on the spoon ways? I can teach you, but aren't you nervous about having to learn something new so quickly? Why would I be nervous? I'm learning from the best. The way I became an egg on a spoon expert was by practicing. Slow and steady. <laughs> The exact opposite way. But you just learned it so fast. Bossy, turtle! I was afraid Roller's antlers would get in the way of putting on clothes and we'd lose for sure. But look! <laughs> in Reindeer Landon, everyone puts their clothes on feet first. Even our hats. And I got the feather blow down. Let's see. Wind velocity is 2.2 knots divided by the length of the field, taking into account the mass of the feather. Perfect! All that's left is for Turtle to dominate with the sponge, and we'll be winners! Come on! Mm -hmm. It's easy. I shout everything I'm doing as I do it so I don't forget. And because <laughs> it's kind of fun to shout. Dunk, run, dance it up, squeeze, run back, dunk, run, dance it up, squeeze, and so on until bucket filled. All oh, right, Bossy! Rad skateboard, kidaroonies. Uh, thanks. <sighs> okay, as an expert, the best place to skateboard is the sidewalk. Next, gear check. Make sure your elbow pads, knee pads, and helmet are nice and tight. Okay, maybe too tight. Wow, Bossy, you know everything. So, do I go fast right away? Um, yeah, sure. Is it easy to slow down? Um, I mean, yeah, probably. How do you steer? You just, uh, you know, kind of do a thing. Bossy, have you skateboarded before? Um, do dreams count? Cause one time I dreamed I was skateboarding in the sky and it was pretty wild. I thought you knew what you were doing. Ugh, I just wasted a perfectly good sheet of paper. Look, how hard can it be? I've seen tons of pro skaters on TV. If they can do it, why can't we? Because they've been practicing their whole lives, and we've never skateboarded before. Just trust me. Check it. Oh, oh. <gasps> <laughs> <Whoa. clears throat> Bossy, are you okay? Never better. Well, it would have been better if I didn't fall, but... <gasps> Bossy, your arm! Oops, guess I scraped it. Come on, let's get you cleaned up. With lots of Boom Boom Super Sawtong bandages? With one Boom Boom Super Sawtong bandage. Welcome to my exam room. How are we feeling today? Any unexplained giggling? Limbs dancing on their own? Does your nose tickle when you flip like this? <laughs> Ow! Oh, you okay, Chipper? It's Dr. Chipper. And I just bumped my tail. Let's keep playing. <clears throat> 
This patient has the worst case of the stickers I've ever seen. <gasps> the cure? Stop wasting stickers. <laughs> Ow! Ugh. Okay, maybe I did hurt my tail. Can someone get my mom? I'll get her, and she'll take you to a real doctor. No! Real doctors are scary. Huh? But you love doctor stuff. I love reading about doctor stuff. And according to the Ultimate Guide to Chipmunk Medicine, a lot can go wrong Ooh. with a tail. They might have to poke it or even... <gasps> Give me a shot. I don't want a shot. I get a little nervous before seeing my doctor, too. But it's always fine. Oh, my poor little bean. We'd better go see Dr. Lamb. Mm. It'll be okay. I had fun at my last checkup. Dr. Lamb gave me a sticker. I got a sticker, too. I got a whole book of stickers. Want to see them? Oh, they're all on my face. Wait, what kind of stickers are they? Fuzzy? Shiny? Scented? I need a fuzzy one for my collection. A fruity one would be great, too. Are we going to have to wait long? Because doing nothing is making me way more nervous. I felt the same when I came here after I bumped my head last month. So did I. I strained my shell. Me three. I twisted my antler. Wait, do you know what this means? That there aren't a lot of doctors in Pleasantburg? Well, yeah. But also, we know all the waiting room secrets to share with Chipper so she can have fun. Like doing puzzles in magazines. Ooh. Pirate pillow fight? We've done that so many times. We need to play something new. Then, do I have the toy for you? The Mega Rare. Ultimate Shukarim Remote Control Car! Who wants to take this cream puff for a spin? Looks like we got a new toy to play with, Fussy. Uh -huh. Fussy? Chipper, can I please have your RC car? I've watched the commercial for it over a zillion billion times. The Mega Rare Ultimate Shoe Cream RC Car is here. It can go off any jump, drive around any obstacle, and nothing can boom, boom, stop it. You can play with it, Bossy. Not just to play with. I'll trade anything for it because I want to keep it forever. No, thanks. I want to keep it. Hmm. I'll trade you my extra rare holographic Captain Candy Corn card. I already have that one. <laughs> okay, I'll trade you all my Boom Boom Super Satan cards. Aussie, what are you doing? Wow, that's a pretty good deal. I'm not interested. You're not interested yet. I will trade you my Boingy Ball. <laughs> How about my Disco Danish action figure with real disco action? Mm -mm. <sighs> I don't want a traitor, but how about one baby sister? Cindy! I would, but I don't know how to change a diaper. <sighs> Mom! Diaper emergency! I got it! What if we put on a show? The more latkes people buy, the more acts we'll perform. I love that idea. We'll call it Latka Palooza. Yay! Yay! Latka Palooza, the greatest show in Pleasantburg. some amazing acts for you tonight. But the only way to see them is if we sell more latkes. So, buy more latkes, everyone!
eating lots of latkes. As a special treat, Ginger's Pops will perform an original latke song. Don't be jelly, don't be jelly. Get some latkes in your belly. Don't be sad, no, don't be sad. Order food from Ginger's Dad. That's Greg and me. The best way to make sure you don't embarrass yourself in front of a huge crowd is by practicing your routine in front of a huge crowd. What? No! But it's not a real crowd. They're just plushies I grabbed from the library. Now, go dance your heart out! They're not real. They're not real. <gasps> Sorry, every plushie. The show has been canceled. But here's a little something for your trouble. Ta-da! I'm sorry, Turtle. I think the plushy audience might have been a step too far. No, it was the right step. It proved there's no way I can dance in front of a real crowd. I can't even dance in front of a fake one without embarrassing myself. <gasps> That's it! You just gotta embarrass yourself so bad today that nothing you do tomorrow will ever be as humiliating. That's the opposite of what I want. Trust me, it's gonna work. Diapers? Did we have to go this embarrassing? No time for questions, bestie. Now let's rock these bad boys in class and really embarrass ourselves. <laughs> Just keep walking. Forget that you're wearing a thing babies wear. Ah, <sighs> no one noticed. That's a relief. No, that's a problem. We need to be humiliated. Hey, everybody. Turtle and I are wearing diapers. <gasps> Bossy, Turtle, where'd you get those super cool toilet pantaloons? What is all this stuff? <laughs> Cucumbers, salt, vinegar, garlic, gochugaru, fish sauce, and sugar. I know exactly what to do. Making kimchi is so easy. The judges say turtle's kimchi is mushy sayo. <gasps> Honey bear made a mess, but Hayoung didn't make anything at all. That means she's out. And it's Turtle versus Honey in the final round, Kimchi Love! Make sure you hit that flip and... Nailed it! Thank you for helping me figure out my routine, Bossy. <laughs> Bossy helped you with your routine. It was his advice that almost cost you the first round. Bossy is gonna be the reason you're gonna lose the whole contest. <gasps> Leave Bossy out of it. I'm the reason I lost the first round. I let you scare me, but I'm not gonna do that anymore. Now stop being so mean. <gasps> hmm. You stood up to her. I did. Kimchi is so cute. Like me, kimchi is a beaut. Like me, kimchi, kimchi wants me play the flute. Wow, that's gonna be tough to beat. Come on, turtle! Be the kimchi. Ah! This is what I call the kimchi shuffle. Start with the cabbage bowl hustle. And right into the one, two, salt step, throw in a flip and a toss in the chest. Dancing, cooking, rhyming so fast. I finish off with the culture garden class. Come on, do the kimchi shuffle. Come on, do the kimchi shuffle. Come on, do the kimchi shuffle. Nice plan, Bessie. But you were on the same one every time we play Capture the Flag. Oh, you remembered. I will beat you. Not if I beat you first. Leaders, remember to have fun while competing against each other. Ugh. Let's take another break. Good effort out there, team, but not good enough. We have to beat Turtle. We're trying, but it's not fun. Yeah, hello, bro. You and Turtle are being really mean to each other. Okay, team. No more fun and games. 
But Miss Elkie says we're supposed to have fun. And she's the teacher. This isn't like you, Turtle. You're being a little bit mean to Bossy. <sighs> Turtle, I let myself get carried away. I've been mean to you. And I'm pushing my team way too hard. I'm sorry. I'm sorry too. I just wanted to be a good leader and win it for my team. But I've been a terrible leader. And an even worse bestie. Miss Elke, I don't want to be the leader of my team anymore. I don't want to be the leader of my team either. That's very sweet. But both of you are going to finish this game as leaders and learn how to have fun, win or lose. Now back to it! Okay, team, let's have fun! Apart, we still win together! Yeah! Doesn't this magic word seem too good to be true? We'll basically be magical wizards! You saw its awesome powers for yourself. That's true, I did. Just imagine all the amazing things we can do with it. Can I borrow your skateboard? Have an ice cream sandwich, please? Please, please, please! Now, let's test this magic word. Yes, please. <laughs> Dad, can we have more dessert? Well, I don't know. It's a bit late, and I... Please! Oh, okay, kid Roonies. Yeah. <sighs> that was magical. <gasps> Turtle, do you think the magic word works over the phone? Only one way to find out. Hello? Hi, Grand Grand. Can I sleep over at Bossy's tonight? Please. Okay, go boogie -ah. She says I can. Yeah! <laughs> Turtle, we gotta use this magic word at the Boo Boom Super Saw Tong Festival tomorrow. That way, we can get everything we want. We need those cards. But we don't have any money. But we do have a magic word. Excuse me, sir. Could we please have a deck of cards? For each of us, please. Sure. Here you go. I'm almost too powerful. It's on! May the best bear win! Flufrun! Doofrun! Florn! That means go! Okay, team. Let's build straight up and never stop. Actually, I think we should start by building a solid foundation at the bottom so our snow bear doesn't collapse. I have just what we need! Did he just leave? All right, team. Let's win this thing and take home that boot. Chipper, can you design a snow bear for us that'll give us maximum height? Already started. Behold, my frost and flugler sucks up snow and spits it out. And with my reindeer land and snow sculpting tools, we can make our snow bear a work of fabulous art. There's no time for art. We need to get all the snow we can before Busy Team takes it. Oh, no! Bossy's team is taking all the good snow. Hurry, Chipper. You can't rush perfection, Bissy. Only I can. And done. Fantastic. Ginger, think you can shovel us up some snow? I was born for this. Shoveling snow is just like scooping piles of shredded potatoes with my dad and pop when we make latkes. Now, let's build this snow bear team. Hey, Kidaroonies! I made my extra special snow day cocoa for you. Yay! Wait, wait, wait. 
while Bissy's team is sipping cocoa, we can keep building and get even more snow. We could have it after we win the boot. Now let's sneak back over there before Bissy notices. Huh? Oh no! Isn't my hot cocoa extra special enough, Bissy? No, it's just Bossy's team is building their snow bear again. Clever, Bossy, but not clever enough. Back to building, team! Sweeping things under the rug. But the rug in my room isn't big enough. But is that really cleaning? And will it even fit under the rug? There's only one way to find out. Room the way! Voila! You can hardly tell all my stuff is under the rug. It doesn't look very... Oh, no! Well, that wasn't supposed to happen. Look, I know you don't want to hear this, but I don't think anything will work except taking our time and doing it right. Or we try one more Bossy Bear super speedy shortcut. This might be the best shortcut I've ever come up with. We're gonna fly my mess out of here. Oh yeah, yeah, I did it, I did it. I really, really did it. And I cannot believe it worked. Me neither. <laughs> and look, the sun hasn't set, which means it's kite time. Bossy, we saw your room and now that it's clean, <gasps> That's strange. Oh! Bossy, when we said to clean your room, we meant to put everything in its proper place, not send it into the sky so it makes a mess across Pleasantburg. I'm sorry. I tried to take shortcuts that clean faster, but it only made my mess bigger. I should have listened to Turtle and took my time cleaning. And that's just what we'll do. We'll go around the neighborhood and clean up the mess the right way no matter how long it takes. We need to find the owner of this toy so we can return it, no matter what. <laughs> now you're talking. Looks like it's time for us to be detectives. These posters of Candy Apple Astronaut are amazing, but I'd make your stem less pointy. Let's make sure we put up enough posters. Everyone has to see them. Have you seen this toy before? Know who it belongs to? Toy? Yours? It's getting late, Bossy. Maybe we should stop searching and try again tomorrow. We can't stop. What about the poor kid who's missing their toy? Hey, what is that? Teeth marks? <gasps> I bet these are the teeth marks of whoever owns it. So if we can find whose teeth match these marks, We'll find the owner. Uh, chipper, Chipper, I uh, can we see your apple? It's a match! Candy Apple Astronaut! You found her! Thanks! <laughs> Chipper's so happy to get her toy back. Doesn't that make you feel happy too? Yeah. At first, I wanted us to keep the toys, so I stalled our search. That was kind of selfish of me, but I'm glad I decided to find its owner. Hey, how would you two like to play with me? You know it. We'd love to. <laughs> Boom Boom Super Satong, Bossy. Thanks, Turtle. I call it Boom Boom Super Satong Extreme. <laughs> Instead of just playing with cards, we act out all the Candy Warriors' moves. Roller! 
Why are you upside down? He must be doing the honey dropper handstand challenge. Oh, you're not doing a handstand. I am not. But honey is one of my favorite things, and the other is snow. And speaking of snow, come outside. Snow? Huh? Where's the snow? Oh, there's no snow. I got something better. Remote controlled snurmobiles to play with. Aren't they awesome? Those look so fun. Can we have a turn? Of course. That's why I brought them here. Come raise them with me. But then we'll have to stop playing Boom Boom Super Satong Extreme. Yeah, but maybe we could stop playing your game for a few minutes, race the snurmobiles, and then go back to it? A few minutes? That's basically forever. Ruler, why don't you play Super Satong Extreme? Then we can race your snurmobiles after. You'll be extremely happy you did. Okay, but I should warn you, in Reindeer Landon, we play a lot of inside games because it's cold and dark for half the year, so I'm gonna win. You're on. Let's boom, boom, super go! Boss Bitsy Kitar Solo, yeah! Okay, Boss Bitsy. We'll let you see what it's like to be older. Now, can some bear pass the gochujang, please? You and Bitsy like your tacos spicy. Can I have some on my taco, too? Are you ready for that heat? If Bissy is, Boss Bissy is, too. Mm. Mm. Oh. You okay, Boss Bissy? I'm uh, sweaty from chewing so much. <gasps> okay, Cindy, it's way past your bedtime. In fact, it's almost Bossy's bedtime. Oh, hey, oh. But not Boss Bissy's bedtime. We older bears get to stay up late. You're right. Say goodnight, Cindy. Cindy! Older bear win! Late bedtime keeps our solo! Yeah! I shouldn't have played that two-hour guitar solo last night. Just need to rest my older bear eyes. <sighs> Morning, Boss Bissy. How'd you like to mix the pancake batter today? I'm making the batter. What do you mean? <laughs> Sorry, Dad. It's okay, Boss Bissy. Now that you're older, you clean up your own mess. What? Oh. Look, a beetle. Let's sneak up on it. In Reindeer Landon, we don't sneak up on bugs. Otherwise, they might fly onto your antlers. Um, the bug just flew onto your antlers. Bossy loves sneaking up on bugs. The beetle has beat it. How about we do something less buggy, like look at the clouds? Let's get looking. Yeah! Why? <sighs> now, this is my best costume. I'm an evil scientist. Whoa! <laughs> the whoa is proof that I'm evil. I'm your henchmunk. <laughs> what do you think, bestie? Hmm. Try wearing this and put your arms like this. There! Are you making me look like Turtle? No. Maybe. Okay, definitely. Stamp, here we come. I. I made it off the ride. Uh, that was the scariest thing ever! We need to get off this ride. Yeah, this stamp isn't worth it. No, 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 no! Let us off the ride! 
right. It's too late, Bossy. We can do this. Together. Hey! This isn't so bad. I might even keep my eyes open. The Terminator, Terminator shall begin, begin in five, four, three, two, two one. Hang on tight, Riders. This is scarier than mashed potatoes! I hope this never ends. We gotta do that again. But first... Congrats for being the first kid to ever smile getting off this ride. And for getting your final stamp. Nailed it! I couldn't have done this without you, Bossy. Bossy? That was terrifying! But I'm glad that I did it with you, Turtle. That your stamp up dream came true! I feel like I could take on any fear now. Me too. Looks like this bear has a date with some mashed potatoes. You don't scare me anymore, you lumpy brute! Ugh. Nailed it! <laughs> <laughs> don't forget about Kenya Rubin and her violin. She's all like... Way to go, sis. How can the mysterious Ray Ventura top him? Allow me to show you. <laughs> Hello, people of Pleasantburg. Welcome back to the biggest, bestest, better than the restest live talent show that we know you've all been waiting for. Okay, judges, we just saw Bob Beaver do his incredible twirling tricks. We saw Kanga Rubin and her out-of-this-world speedy violin playing. Then there was the mysterious Ray Ventura and his dazzling tricks. Mystery! <laughs> and my personal favorite, Hamma Piglet and her speed paintings. <laughs> Who will win the coolest talent show on the planet? The contestant who will win Pleasantburg's God Pizzazz is... Oh, I guess the power's back. Should we watch the show now? No way. We're having too much fun. Yeah. Imagining the show is more fun than watching it. Plus, the show will still be there tomorrow. Exactly. Now... Let's find out who won our show! Judges. And the winner is... Cindy! That lightning has oddly good timing. <laughs> you! I'm on my last job card. It's the teacher's helper card. It has ten more jobs on it! Maybe we should ask Miss Elke for help. No way! There's only one thing for us to do. Move super mega hyper fast and we can play games! Go, go, go! Ah! I ruined the pencil! Ah! Everything's funny! Ah! It's the end of the school day! We didn't finish everything in time! Just keep going, bestie. Hey, job doers. Thanks again for doing all our jobs. Are you ready to line lead us to the bus? We're too busy to lead you. Just make a line and walk in it. We've never walked in a line without leaders before. We'll be stuck at school forever. Every kid for themselves! Bossy, Turtle, I think you can see why we share the class jobs. It's just too much work for two kids. How would you like some help? Bus driver Dan, can you keep that bird in the nest for a while? 
Over. Roger, Elky Blazer. I'll be here when the kids are ready. Over. Now, who wants to help Bossy and Turtle? The only ones who can make jobs extra fun and extra good. Yep, the system of division of labor is there for a reason. I have no idea what I just said. I think you said everything's better when everyone works together. It's time to line up. Welcome to the trading tunnel. Jojo has a deal on some nice felt tip markers. Some of them even have their caps. <laughs> Happy trend, boys! The footprints stop here. That could only mean one thing. The backpack taker flew away in a helicopter. Maybe the backpack is still here. Let's split up and look for it. Or did you not take Rolla's backpack? Tell me now, Louie! What are you even talking about? All right, you're free to go. This time. But I'm watching you. <gasps> An antler? Ruler's backpack has antlers. You're not getting away that easy. Have you seen a purple backpack with antlers? Have you seen a purple backpack with antlers? Does anyone have a snack? I can't solve a case when I'm hungry. Where'd your sunglasses go? I traded them for this pretzel. Those are my parents. Turtle's great-grand-grand and great pop-pop at their restaurant. Oh, it was famous for its delicious japchae. Japchae is my all-time favorite food. Me too! I love the noodles. No, the mushrooms. No, the spinach. No, I love the memories. My tea's ready. Excuse me, cuties. Something fell out of the book. <gasps> it's the Japchae recipe from Grand Grand's parents. This gives me a shell-tastic idea. Grand Grand misses my great Grand Grand and Pop Pop's Japchae, so let's make it for her. Great idea, Bestie. Not only are we gonna make Grand Grand the same Japche, we're gonna make a whole restaurant. That's a greater idea. But a whole restaurant? How do we do that? I know two people who aren't doing anything, have plenty of free time, and love all my ideas. Turn the whole house into a restaurant for Grain Grant. Are you in or are you in? We love helping Gran Gran. Let's get cooking. I can help too. Ooh. Ooh. Cindy! Yeah. Yay. So, what do you kidaroonies want the restaurant to look like? It's like my great grandparents' restaurant. Oh, I was thinking outer space. Grain Gran would love space chop chick. That sounds like two different restaurants. Oh, you guys could combine them. I guess that could work. Of course it can. And I got all the space stuff we need. <sighs> <sighs> That's a good batch, but we gotta fan it out. I can't smell the mundu anymore. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, we gotta keep this up until the show and smell ends. Uh, yeah, peasy, peasy. Uh, easy, peasy. Uh, 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 uh. <sighs> Sorry.
sorry, Bestie. I think we need another plan that doesn't involve our arms. What should we do? <laughs> Miss Selkie's skunk flower is our answer. I'll get it to spray me, and then no one will be able to smell anything but me. <laughs> yeah! Whoa! A little to the right. No, to the left. <laughs> Maybe I should stand on your shoulders, Bossy. No way! The skunk flower needs to spray me, so I can be so smelly, no one notices your Grand Grand's Mondu. Almost got it. And... Aha! Bear down! Oh! Ah, <sighs> oh, you smell like hot garbage. <gasps> it worked. Hmm. Uh, stink! I really stink. Ah, uh, it's so stinky. And it's all over me. Get the smell off! Incoming wet wipe. Remind me never to do that again. <laughs> well, Jelly, would you like to join us for dinner? He's way too valuable to be around food. Can you imagine if I brought something as fragile as a car to the dinner table? Would you like some jelly so you can grow big and strong? Why, yes, I would. Thank you, Bossy. I'm feeling stronger already. So he's made of jelly, and he eats jelly. Ugh, gross! It's not gross, it's awesome! Okay, maybe it is a little gross. Yum! Uh, bossy, why is the cart so sticky? Uh, hmm, must be all the jelly he ate. See you tomorrow, Jelly Juggernaut! Wow, that card looks stickier than reindeer land in syrup on Froof and Frugal. I'm surprised you're okay with that, Turtle. <sighs> I'm not, but I can't say anything. Bossy lets me do whatever I want on my days with the card. I need to do the same for him. You know, you could laminate it. That covers it in a protective coating. Ooh, shiny! Hmm. <sighs> This card looks like it's been through a lot. Good idea to laminate it. So, how's sharing the card going? Eh, not great. But once you laminate it, the card will stay clean and all my problems will be solved. Lamination can't solve all your problems, kid. Sharing the card's not working. One of you has to be in charge. But which one of us? There's no fair way to decide. Maybe there is. Think about it, kid. I will. Thank you. You're very wise. Ah, gee. I laminated my tie again. I can't. I'll just mess things up. And then she'll never want me to be your tour guide for anything ever again. Okay. I'll still be the tour guide. Don't worry. Oh. This ride doesn't look that scary. It's terrible and scary! Yeah. I'm tour guiding as hard as I can, but Grand Grand is giving me nothing. I'm sorry, Turtle. I can't give her the best forever. I've been watching Grand Grand on the past few rides, and I think I noticed her looking at one with a real smile. Why didn't you say so? I wasn't confident, but seeing you try so hard makes me want to try hard, too. It's my turn now. It's time for me to be the best tour guide ever and give my Grand Grand the best time ever. I like the sound of that. Where are we off to, my little Kobogia? Hold it! You need this. Thanks! Welcome to the Turtle Tour. I'll be your other amazingly handsome, super cool tour guide. Now, Let's go to the Lazy River. Now this ride is uh, the best ride I've ever been on. Turtle, I saw you were a little nervous to be a tour guide, and that's why you let Bossy do it. But you're doing an excellent job. <gasps> the 
this is the cutest moment in the history of moments. <laughs> and Bossy, you're a great oh, friend. Uh, uh, no, this is the cutest moment ever. Oh. Careful, let's not rock the tube oh. now. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Clay for the base? Uh, we're gonna need more clay, Bestie. Uh, uh, got it! Uh, uh, oh. More clay, and more clay, and more clay, <laughs> and more clay. Uh, uh, is that enough clay, Bestie? I think so, Bestie. We did it! We made a super duper super awesome super sciencey volcano! And we're ahead of schedule by 15 minutes and 40 seconds. What should we do? There's only one thing to do. Show off our project to Bissy and Ginger. Flimsy sweet ginger! <laughs> it's like a glow-in-the-dark galaxy party. Go, Bissy and Ginger, go! We're like, no, Bissy and Ginger, no! Our project needs to be the coolest so we can become hall monitors. But what else can we do? Hmm. Maybe we could add a little galaxy party energy to our project. As much as I want to build something like that, I'm proud of our volcano and don't want to change it and make it too complicated. Turtle, keep your eyes on the prize. Being hall monitors. Just imagine it. Pull passes, please. Okay, I'm up for changing it. Let's take this project to the next dimension of cool. Too far? No way! This is what it's gonna take to win the science fair. So boring. Oh. I just gotta find a telescope lens. Maybe this one? Bossy, wake up! Remember Operation Fun for Us and Dad? Glasses? Boring. Old cameras? Fragile and boring. Fake eyeballs? Ugh. This place even makes fake eyeballs boring. We're doomed. <gasps> no, we're not. Look, Dad loves video game headsets. Okay, I found the lens so we can... <gasps> no way. Video game headsets? Can we play with them? Please? Okay, but we have to make yeah! it quick if we're going to stay on schedule. Balloons. <laughs> yeah! Ah! You've been playing with those headsets for an hour now. Are you gonna buy them or what? An hour? I gotta buy this lens. Please hurry. Unless you're busy. Dad? Is the game over? Oh! <gasps> What are we doing? Kickball? Free sag? Boom Boom Super Sawtong Tournament? Roller taught us a new ranger landing game yesterday called Doof Laden. It's a little complicated, but super fun. It's not complicated at all. I'll explain the rules. You can't move unless the Doof Laden says stop. And if the Doof Laden says jump, you spin around. But if the Doof Laden says clap, then you stomp your feet. Oh, I forgot. Make sure to doop laden, doop laden, doop laden. And those are all 93 rules. Got it, Bossy? Why don't we watch the first couple of rounds while everyone else plays, and I'll explain what's going on. And miss the first round? No way! Now pass me the doop laden! Bossy, the doop laden isn't a ball. I did not know that, but now I do. I'm sure it'll all make sense when I start playing. The Doof Laden says clap. <laughs> Sorry, Bossy, but you're out. You must go to the Doof Box. 
this game makes no sense. And what is a doof box? When you're knocked out of the game, you go sit in the corner until everyone else is out. <sighs> oh, I can't believe I missed out on this yesterday. Thanks, tummy ache. Sorry. How are you and your tummy doing? <laughs> oh, I'm great. This is exactly where I want to be. The doof box is the exact opposite of where you want to be, Bossy. Hey, Bossy, if you want, I can teach you how to paint during lunch. And maybe Roller can teach you how to play doof lot and afterwards. And miss out on lunch? It's okay. There's no way I missed out on anything else yesterday. City. I want to be friends with you Near or far, wherever you are Can we be friends? We can climb a tree, pretend we're lost at sea But please, can we be friends? We can eat some sandies while we lie in our jammies But please, can we be friends? Oh yeah, let's be friends City. I would like to give you my super cool Boom Boom Super Satong card as a token of my friendship. So what do you say? Will you be friends with me? Thank. <sighs> he basically just said no. Was it something I said? I don't get it. We did everything to show Sadiq a fun time, and he doesn't seem to want to be our friend. Did I do something wrong? I don't think so. We gave it our all. Bossy, Turtle, I want to thank you so much for showing Sadiq around today. I don't think we were a good welcoming committee. Sadiq had a terrible time. What? His parents came to pick him up, and he couldn't stop talking about what an amazing day he had, and how welcome you both made him feel. What? But he didn't say anything to us. Not everyone expresses their excitement in the same way. That doesn't mean that he didn't feel welcome. That makes perfect sense. Everyone expresses themselves differently. So, we are friends? This is amazing! I hope we can play with Sadiq again tomorrow. I am the magical Yeti. Nice try, but you're not real. Ahem, I said I am the magical Yeti. <gasps> I can't believe Busy's not here to see the magical Yeti is real. Congratulations, you found me. So, stop being sad. Bye-bye. Whoa, whoa, what about our wishes? Oh, yeah, that's a thing that dad, uh, your dad said I do. So, what do you each wish for? What about Bissy? Yeah! We both have the same wish. We want Bissy, my awesome older sister, to believe in you again. Aww. I mean, your wish has been granted. Thank you, thank you. We have to go tell Bissy. Wait, where's Bissy? Oh, ahem. there she is. I was looking for you to tell you that you both were so right. I believe that the magical Yeti is real. <gasps> we, we did, did it. it, we did it. We met the Yeti and made a wish for you to believe in it again. And you do, so it's all true. Really? Wow. Thanks, boys. <laughs> Good night, Bissy. <gasps> Could it be? <laughs> you can ask your parents to subscribe to the Nick Jr. YouTube channel for new videos every day. And find more of your favorite shows on TV on Nickelodeon and the Nick Jr. channel.